this is meena here welcoming you to my channel grow joyfully i'm explaining the process of making panchakavya at home in urban context the recipe i have taken is from the tamil nadu agricultural university the duration is 33 days and it's got three stages in this video i'm explaining the stage 3 in stage 1 we added cow dung and cow ghee both from native cows and we mix them morning once evening once for 3 days we transferred the contents in stage 2 to a drum and then we added cow urine and water and for the next 15 days we have been stirring morning and evening in stage 3 we are going to use two more products of the cow the desi milk 3 liters and curds which is made out of the milk 2 liters we are also going to add a lot of additives here sugar cane juice 1 liter well ripened bananas 12 jaggery 3 kgs and tender coconut water 3 liters these additives accelerate the fermentation they remove any unacceptable odor in the mix and they also provide an excellent substrate for the microorganisms to flourish and thrive and they do add a lot of micronutrients to panchakavya as well as far as tender coconut water is concerned i usually uh, take it as 1 uh, liter from 3 tender coconuts <coughs> we get this uh, balls of jaggery so i cut them into smaller pieces and uh, simply put them in 2 liters of water lukewarm water i use so it becomes easy to dissolve it ingredients for stage 3 of panchakavya making ready i am showing you 3 liters of the desi cow milk 2 liters of uh, curd 1 liter of sugar cane juice 3 liters of tender coconut water 12 bananas well ripened bananas mashed and 3 liters of jaggery soaked in lukewarm 2 liters of water so it is not 100% pound but as we stir every day for the next 15 days uh, it will dissolve automatically and i'm showing you the contents this is uh, stage 2 everything is nicely mixed here and now i'm going to add all the contents I'm adding tender coconut water. Adding three liters of milk. Adding the mashed bananas. Adding sugar cane juice. Adding jaggery now. adding curds now now i'll rinse all these vessels and i'll add some more water i added all the ingredients give it a very very thorough stir for one full minute now this has to be continued daily for the next 15 days once in the morning once in the evening giving a thorough stir the stick has to reach the bottom so that thorough stirring happens two points to be noted here this is going to ferment quite a lot especially in the next few days so when you use a container you must ensure that uh, a lot of space is available for the fermentation to happen like our uh, idli dough in india fermenting in summer so if you fill it to the brim then what will happen is that the froth will come out and it will become a messy affair and it will be resulting in a lot of wastage also usually i do two batches and hence i will take one third of this and put it in another container and i will continue the stirring every day the second point to be noted is that now that we have added a lot of sweet stuff in the form of jaggery etc rats will be attracted towards it so it's extremely important that you take the cotton piece of cloth with two layers and tie it very very tightly 
tight very tightly and keep it in a safe place in a shady place this picture was taken one day after the stage 3 contents have been added you can observe the nice frothing that is happening that is why it is important that your bin has got extra space in order to take this frothing into account in my next video i will share how to make use of panchakavya effectively for your plants and what are the benefits that accrue to the plants if you use panchakavya regularly panchakavya is a wonderful fertilizer it's a miracle fertilizer we can say excellent organic fertilizer so we need to understand the chemical properties and the microbial load in panchakavya you may choose to make panchakavya only for yourself or you may be selling it or you may simply say i would like to buy panchakavya so i have a lot of useful tips to share whichever category you belong to and i'll share them in my next video thank you for watching my video have a great day